So it's quite understandable that people believe in a me or a self. You know, it's it's actually it's it's completely understandable because uh, we have a stream of impressions through our senses, through our thoughts and feelings, and so on, which is constantly running. And there, you know, that's that this is a me, and I can feel what's happening here, but I can't feel what's happening out there. You know, all this, of course, gives us the idea that there is a real entity we can call ourselves, which is, in its essence, existent. But if we really look at it, we see that this doesn't seem to be the case, right? It doesn't seem to be the case, because none of the things that are personal, how we look, our body, how we think and feel, you know, our past and our direction and so on, None of this is lasting. If we look for that which is lasting, it's not the pictures, it's the mirror behind the pictures. It's not the waves, it's the depth of the ocean. And actually that which is conscious right now, looking through our eyes and listening through our ears, is the same in everybody because it is radiant conscious space. Here you can look at it in this in three ways, you know, you can look at it from an analytical way, you say there's nothing there. You can look at that's mainly the Gelugpa school of the Dalai Lama school, which think like that. Then the three old schools, the Red Hat schools, the unreformed schools, they usually say that, yeah, it's all right, you know, but there's somebody being aware of that, right? So there is emptiness and that which is aware is also empty, but it's there, right? There is a consciousness there. And then the third thing is then, of course, the experience of the yoga is that it is intensely blissful. That deep meditation is just really joyful. Right now, I feel my hair stands up, you know, and so on. And that's a sign that all the energy is spread out in all directions. And and it's very, very blissful. It's a very joyful, very wonderful experience. And that this experience of joy is inseparable from space. This is maybe the most wonderful thing.